Mark, what's your ETA? I'm heading back now. Over. Proceed to 26.133 degrees north, 3.628 degrees east. Got it. Hello everyone, I'm Grand Admi and welcome to Anno 2205. It's launch day and I'm back. So, a um, couple of notes. Uh, I'm doing this without a sound test. So, I'm probably going to fiddle with sound over the next couple of episodes. If my voice is too loud, I'm sorry. It will probably be fixed tomorrow. Or if the game volume's too low, uh, it will be fixed tomorrow. Really, all I want to do is get started with play. So, let's go ahead. And, first off, let's uh, just kind of take a look at everything. Um, we'll see what I need to set in here. Chances are this is not what uh, the game will be played on, starting later. Audio, sounds good. Game plays, and in fact... We're going to go ahead and, um, hmm, this, we'll have to see how that is. Yes, I do have 2205 gold, but no, I didn't get to participate in the beta. That's the credits. I don't care about the credits. And that should be exit. So, let's go ahead and start a game. You accepted my invitation. Samantha Beaumont. Global Union Supervisor of the Lunar Licensing Program. We have a lot to discuss. But first, I'd like to introduce you to your artificial data amalgamating messenger. Thank you for participating in the Lunar Licensing Program. The program stipulates that your corporation set up operative spaceports to act as bases for a new wave of lunar colonization. You will further assist Global Union in the development of a fusion energy reactor to avert Earth's impending energy crisis. Okay. Officially, only mega corporations are allowed in the program, but I personally took a stand for you. You just have to sign in with your corporation name. Okay, so. What shall our corporation game? Well, we're going to be Emeraldy Corp Incorporated, or Emeraldy Inc. Emeraldy Inc. Period. Have to conform to grammar. Thanks. Corporation Thanks. logo. See your corporate logo as well for identification purposes. So we get all these logos, just like in any typical. Oh, hey, look! Throwback to uh, twenty. Uh, What is it? 2050? No, 2070. There we go. With new with the uh, Initiative Global Trust. So I think to start out, we are going to go. Uh, let's see here. I like that one. I like that one. I think I wanted to do this one. That looks awesome. My superiors at the Global Union had reservations about you. Okay. But I convinced them. 
They even decided to allocate you high-grade territory for new corporate headquarters. Choose a sector. So we can start in one of the three sectors here. Walwork Basin, Cape Ambar, and Viridian Coves. Project for Ornamentals and Viridian Coves, which is also the biggest map but has the fewest mountain sites and a middle amount of coastal building sites. Cape Ambar is the smallest map with 14 mountain sites, 32 coastal, and is the project for rare materials. And we'll work recent. That is the power map. That's the one that we were seeing in all of the previews, where we had the the three dams, 17 mountain sites, 24 coastal sites, pro and this is the project for energy. Um. Let's see here. Let me read descriptions. With one remote and several large islands, while Repression is rich in mineral resources and provides ample room for settlement, basically known for its defunct dam, which fell into ruins decades ago. Don't Keep. want to be rude, but we have a tight schedule. Oh, I'm getting to it, Samantha. Cape Ambar is a cluster of islands, allowing easy access to many riches of the sea. Uh, rumor has it that lost connect technologies lie just beneath the surface. While Viridian Coves, small, hardly colonizable island is the gate to the vast plains of the Viridian Coves. Beautiful scenery, uh, scenery is the site of Global Union's latest prestige project. Um, I think we will start in Cape Amber, mainly because I know what lies beneath the ocean here. No, I haven't played any. Almost there. We just have to negotiate the terms of your contract with Global Union. Funding conditions and the like. Um. Okay. Uh, we're going to go straight to expert because I've played Anno since 16. What was it? 1605? No, it wouldn't be 1605. It would be 1603. There, it's, there it is. Getting my my games mixed up. So, 50,000 startup capital. Reduced rare house output and reduced revenue per employee. Let's launch. Admiralty Inc. and Cape Amber. Entering phase one of the lunar licensing program. The global union assigned you territory in Earth's temperate region to establish a spaceport and a base of operations. The construction of a space elevator to global union headquarters is also required. For further instructions, Speak to your official contact person. Global Union wishes you success. Okay. A true island paradise, don't you think? The coastal area here is very rich in natural resources. I wonder if that's the reason why a member of the Big Five is planning for an underwater research project. Hmm, who's the Big Five? But for now, that's secondary. The protocol demands that you establish a spaceport in this area. Okay. The spaceport building site off the coast is still unstaffed. But as soon as you've built the necessary housing, your construction team will be moving in. Okay. So. Um, I'm going to go ahead and actually pause here for a second. So I can go into settings and let's see what this free camera is. There we go. Okay, this is my this is more like it. So here's my warehouse. Sufficient logist okay. I know it's a lot of things to keep in mind. But Adam compiled you a database. That's fine. Um corporation level one, next level at hundred and two employees. Okay. So we've got what? Goods here. This is in the temperate zone. There's three zones. Lunar Moon, Temperate, and Arctic. We need bioresin, biopolymers, because plastics are so 2070s. Oh, uh, the Easter eggs, and organic food, basic and biotic. Okay. So.
Interesting. So we need to build. We need to attract a population of 50 workers. So everything must be connected to the warehouse. Got it. Okay. So I think we will go ahead and start out here. And we'll just kind of run it on back. Let's see here. We'll do so. Looks like we unlocked the entire island from the beginning. No more uh, warehouses. That's good. Let's go ahead and start in on you. Um, one thing I'm no okay. So biopolymer or is our first basic one. Let's go. Let's do a block. I'm gonna say let's do blocks of five. Nice apartments. Makes me look forward to quitting time. All right, so we got. But I'm not jumping for joy either. Okay, so you need organic food, water, and information in order to expand. Uh, definitely do want to do biopolymers. He uses bioresin, so we need to do bioresin. Okay, and it should be yep. And middle mouse button, awesome. Let's go ahead and drop you down. And you produce. This should be interesting. So let's go here and do the resin warehouse on the opposite side. Ooh, that's going to drive me nuts. But it fits right there. Okay. And that was completely unintentional. Now we just need to watch the production here and make sure. We're missing workforce. So workforce is a thing. Okay, let's go ahead and get um, production per minute. Ooh, that's awesome. You produce 10 bioresin per minute. You produce 10, 10 and consume 10. This is awesome. Facilities require additional manpower. I heard, I heard. Okay. And we'll go a rice farm Organic here. Organic food is perceived as needless luxury by many megacorps. Good to see you share the union's perspective. And what's... Copy is C. That's different. And bring in... Uh, ten the more. suffers from a shortage of workforce. This impairs productivity. Now, let's talk about the next few steps. Okay, we need to reach a positive balance. That's fine. Let's go ahead and do that and that. Really you. Complain, but I'm not New blueprints ready for implementation. Okay. So you only give me. Good. We um, procedure in mind in future. Hold on. Five times five is in fact twenty-five. And I have a personnel shortage. So I need thirty-five workers. Okay. What do we have now? We got the transportation. Factories, logistics, services. So these give a. So this gives us logistics. Okay, and this uses. Okay, so these require logistics maintenance. Okay, so I think what I want to do is I want to. Do you require a road connection? That's my question. Let's see here. A wind park. Nice and large. Let's situate you here. Let's situate... Ah, oh, darn. But I should then... Yeah, you can sit there. Keep pressing in. Supposed to be C, it's now C for that. 
Let's go with another one of you. And another one of you. Let's go here with five more. And another five here. Five more here. And five more here. And then just remember to do the roads. Like so. Your construction crew is one of the first ready. Keep up the pace. Your competitors will try to catch up. Okay. For the next construction stage, you'll need qualified ground staff to operate the spaceport. Make sure to adhere to union standards while providing the required infrastructure. Attention. Workforce too low to meet the And you do require road. Okay. So, attention. Under provision of specific consumer goods detected. Come here. Do I have access to the water? I do, in fact, have access to water, which I can do here, or I can do here. I think we'll go. Human resources insufficient. Let's go here. Quick, just connect you up. These days, it's the only way to come by drinkable water. Now you guys are competitive edge. Sharpen. are highly satisfied need a population of 200 workers for the infodome your industry suffers from a shortage of workforce this impairs productivity okay no big deal very good we should standardize the process okay so I want to build a road down here And connect it there. Is V still? Oh, okay. B is not. D is demolish. Because I want to get rid of that road. And I want to get rid of. This road. I'm already being inefficient. God damn it. With my road design. That will have to fix. Fortunately, they didn't change the button for streets. It's good. And this is going to be my first block of three. And this is going to take some getting used to. Alright. See? It's working now. Basic. Alright. So, information. New building types possible. Okay, so if I go build infodome, you sit there so it ha so I can see the radius of it. That's nice. Do you do not fit in that area? No. So you'll range of information services sit there. Enable your employees to develop their interests as well as their skills. And run you here. And then copy you over. Oh. What can I say? You are fully satisfied. That's nice to know. So I can do something like this and do some sort of ornamental in the middle. Alright, let's go ahead and... Oh, I was pressing I. Remarkable progress. You've assembled construction crews and ground personnel faster than I was expecting. You are more than ready for the first. So let's go ahead and get you guys upgraded. The program demands you connect your city with the Global Union Space Station via a space elevator. Okay. So far, only megacorps like the Big Five use such technology. But I'm sure you have the same potential. Mm, that's the sector project. Yep, I can see the arc. Place them apart from each other for optimal. Factory supply with logistics. Okay. 
So. Again, construction global spaceport. Competitive edge. Sharpen. Okay. Well, I'm making money. Wow. Okay. So we need to produce this constructor bots. Tree so five cobalt, five nano. That's a felt. Okay, I wanted to grab that. That's two biopolymers. Got a mountain build site here and a site there. Then, of course, this is the bridge. We can link islands using these bridges. As, um, hmm. Got this spot here, which I really aren't going to do much with. Because it's here on the edge of the city. So if I go here with a Feldspar Quarry. Do a road there. Transportation center can sit here. And we can throw power there. Okay, so I can I see where the radiuses are. So we want to maximize efficiency. Warning. Energy demand can no longer be met. Okay. Then we want to extend this out to here and do area block. Oh, wrong thing. Okay. Well. Let's see here. Alright, well. I'm going to look at sound levels. And I will see you guys all tomorrow. This is Anno 2205. I am excited for it. Just need to learn the, um all of the ways of building or all the buildings now and I will be with it be in here with uh, my usual anno efficiency so until next time I'm Grand Admi thank you for joining me here today I'll see you all later take care